Hey, Mike, Yanni has found a patio in somebody's backyard, a lucky BT viewer's backyard, Mike. Beautiful morning to be outside here, Ted, uh, and he wants a beautiful morning to surprise some BT viewers with a little, uh, little prize. They won a contest. I'm going to introduce you to Allison, Matt, and Holly. Thank you for having us in your backyard this morning. You're you won the $5,000 Scott's Miracle Grow Backyard Makeover. This is the space that you guys want to transform. It actually, you know what? It looks nice, but you guys want to change it. Well, it needs some help. Um, we, we moved in late August last year, so the growing season's starting, and we're sort of learning what is coming up, um, what's a weed, what isn't. Well, you never know when you take over somebody's house, right? That's what did they have planted the year before. Exactly. You have no idea, so it's kind of a surprise. Yeah, yeah, and we've got two little ones, um, a three-year-old, a three-month-old, so, um, you know, it's finding the time as well. To take care of our yard, so this is really helpful. We're really excited. Well, I don't understand. You just have two young kids. What do you mean you don't have any time to do this, Matt? <laughs> I, I, yeah, I wish we uh, we were more diligent in the backyard, but we'll use them as an excuse for now. And clearly, you have your hands full this morning. Yes, another one's sleeping, thankfully, right now. So, <laughs> well, thankfully, we have some help on hand. John from Green Gate Garden Center, you've been you've come in here. You've already got some ideas of what we can do with the five thousand dollars from Scott's Miracle Grow. There's lots of different options. We can just make um, do some tidying up. It's always good. Do some pruning, get some um, garden cleanup, um, plant some new color into the garden, stuff that's as easy as possible for the next few years, and then go from there. Do a lot of people like the whole no maintenance idea? Plants that are simple that they don't have to continuously monitor throughout the year. Well, it's not no maintenance, but okay. low maintenance. Okay. Low you still maintenance. have to do a little bit of work. Unless you yeah. put plastic, we could put plastic plants around the yard. Yeah. But then, well, why am I here? <laughs> I, I think yeah. you guys want more than plastic flowers, though, right? I think so. Yeah, I think uh, I think you know teaching our kids as well about gardening is important so right. and I guess one of the things too and John just kind of step in here is you have to think about sun and how much heat's going to be on the different flower beds and things yeah. like that well right plant right place right so full sun plants and full sun shade and so on and so forth and things that will grow properly for them so they'll succeed right, right. Well, it's a little bit chilly this morning but you know what we are going to be uh, putting everyone to work here uh, we're going to you know going to tidy up and uh, do a little bit of makeover here and uh, for the BT viewers watching this morning if you have any gardening questions for John we're going to be periscoping between each segment so anything you want to know about gardening this is your guy to ask so uh, make sure to go to uh, at BT Calgary on Periscope Twitter and you can join the conversation there and throw your questions it's gonna be a great morning Ted